Hi guys, in this video I get to use this beautiful, stunning palette from Charlotte Tilbury. I finally got my hands on the Pillow Talk Eyeshadow Quad. And if you'd like to see how I created this eye look using this palette, please keep watching. Hi guys, my name is Ange and thank you so much for joining me on my channel. I like to upload makeup beauty, lifestyle videos aimed at the more mature woman because I strongly believe that we can still be fabulous over 50. If that sounds like you, please consider subscribing to my channel by clicking on the subscribe button down below. Now, this stunning, beautiful palette, the Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk. It retails for 53 US dollars and I will leave links down below as to where you can obtain this beautiful palette. It is 5.2 grams of product and it in true form of Charlotte Tilbury comes with the Prime Enhance Smoke and Pop eyeshadows. So she doesn't give them names, she just gives them 1, 2, 3, 4 Prime Enhance smoke and pop and the pop color is always a sheer sort of topper shimmery color that you can just use your finger and pop it over the top of your shadow to basically do that give it a pop very basic in the way she sets out her eyeshadow quads and I love that so you use the prime shade all over your lid you use the enhanced shade to do the outer corner and maybe your crease and you use the smoke shade to deepen any of the areas in the outer portion of your eye and maybe under your eye as well so simple takes the thought takes the angst out of creating a beautiful eye look with the way she lays her quads out and I just think it's fabulous. The Prime is a champagne pink with a shimmer finish. The Enhance is a dusty rose with a matte finish and the Smoke is a soft brown with a matte finish. The Pop is a sheer rose gold with a sparkle finish and it is just truly a stunning palette. Okay so with that out of the way Let's get into the eye look. Gosh, getting older, my hair is thinning. Never mind. Okay, so we are going to tuck into this beautiful palette, the Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk. And I have already primed my eyes with the sh mm, shot. I've already primed my eyes with the Tarte Shape Tape and then set with a loose powder. And we're going to go in with the first shade, the Prime Shade, with a Sephora Pro Shader Brush. I got this on sale at the Sephora New Zealand site a wee while ago. And I'm just taking that from... Lash to brow, all over. Now I have been using this palette and it's gorgeous. Okay, so taking a Morphe R37 blending brush, I'm going to go in with the second enhanced shade, the one just here. And I'm going to start that on the outer corner of my eye, just blending that out and up. And then a cross in the higher part of my hood just to add some dimension to my eye. Now the good thing about applying the enhanced shade from lash to brow is that because I've taken it right up to my brow it's going to act as an eye highlighter as well which is something I don't normally do. So just blending that in like so. It's 
such a warm pink colour. So that is with the enhanced shade. Now I'm going to go in with the smoke shade, which isn't as dark as I'd like, but it is still beautiful as a quad. And I'm going to take that using, sorry, my Sonia G Worker One brush. So I'm just taking the smoke shade in the same area that we added the enhanced shade just on the outer and I'm not going to drag that across into the socket not at the moment anyway it's such a beautiful eyeshadow palette but then I am really a sucker for Charlotte Tilbury. I love the um, Icon palette. I love the 12 pan palettes that she bought out. I'm going to use the smoke shade and run it under my eye. And then just connect it to the top portion where I've been shading. Now the fun pop shade. I'm going to use my finger with that and I'm just going to apply it on the centre of my lid. Just to add a something something. And that's just gorgeous. Now this eyeshadow look is is gorgeous as well if you want to dramatize it up a little bit by adding more of a darker brown to the outer. But these colours are just so complementary to brown eyes, I feel. And I think they would suit a lot of eye colours, but I just love them on my brown eyes. And I'm going to take a small pencil brush and I'm going to take the first prime shade and just add that in the inner corner. like so. I'm going to take the Marc Jacobs Highliner Gel Liner in Blacker and I am just going to line my eyes, pop some mascara on and I'll be right back. Okay guys so this is the finished look. I added the black eyeliner to the top and bottom waterline of my eyes. I added a little bit of mascara to my already dramatic eyelash extensions but I just wanted to va va voom it up just a little bit. I love this colour on my brown eyes. What do you think? Love to hear from you in the comments below. Now because I've fallen in love with this palette so much, I'd like to hear from you if you would like to see the more rosy gold palette exaggerise. I have it on my wish list, but it'll be up to you guys if I purchase it to do a, another look with a Charlotte Tilbury eyeshadow quad. If you enjoyed that guys, please give it a thumbs up. I truly appreciate it. If you would like to see more videos from me, please feel free to tap or click on either of these here to view some more videos. And I hope you've all had a beautiful and a wonderful day. And I look forward to seeing you next time. See you later guys. Bye.